Nobody does Star Wars like the power of the Force from Kenner. Hey folks, welcome to a very belated return to Power of the Force Fridays. We're kicking off back again. My Power of the Force 2 collection is able to be finally accessible again, uh, as well as my entire figure collection. It's not out on display as yet at the time of this recording, but I have access to it. And um, I wanted to return to Power of the Force Fridays. It was something I was having a lot of fun doing um, in the past. So it's, it's making a comeback. Um, so bear with me for the coming weeks as I try and organize a lineup of figures to do. Um, talk about some of these Power of the Force figures, making sure that there's ones I haven't done twice, so I don't want to do them twice, so I've got to reassert my catalogue and look at what I've done, and uh, yeah, we're going to go just go far and follow ahead with uh, new Power of the Force figures. New. Uh, <laughs> this is this is a harken back to my childhood and a lot of others. I know there's a gruesome great nostalgia, and this is one I actually picked up over the last few months, the Gamorrean Guard. Now, one I never had as a kid either, so to have one now is really, really cool. Um, the Gamorian Guard, the most recent one in the Vintage Collection, and the Black Series version are probably still to this day two of the greatest figures that Hasbro's ever done. Um, there's a lot of highlights. It's hard to narrow it down. But just with the size, the sheer size of this, these figures, they're just so good. Um, and yeah, like I said, never had this one as a kid. Um, I do need to give him a bit of a bath because <laughs> he is a little bit dirty by the looks of it. Maybe he's meant to be like that. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'll give him a wash anyway. Um, he may have just gathered a bit of dust. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the weapon he came with. I've just sort of pilfering through uh, a box of figures that I've sort of collected over the last 12, 18 months. And um, yeah, this one was in there. So I'm like, this is the prime opportunity for a comeback. Um, Power of the Force Fridays, right here on the Force of Jesse channel. <laughs> and yeah, it's, it's just fun to talk about these figures, not necessarily go into a depth review about detail, because we all know they're sort of just beefed up He-Man figures basically, but um, it is nostalgia, man, it is nostalgia. You used to stare at these figures on the back of the packaging. What else was out there? What was what were we looking forward to getting? What did we not want to ask for Christmas, birthdays, all that kind of stuff? Bottom of the feet, nineteen ninety seven LFL. Kenna China. He just a uh, just a nice beast of a figure. And a punching fist. Just an aesthetically pleasing figure. He does have pose, poseable ability at the waist too, so a bit more than 5 POA, 6 POA on this figure actually. <laughs> so that's cool. Let's take a look at his handsome devil face. Let's get all up in there. If the camera wants to focus that is, if not, we're just going to have to sit back a little bit and just enjoy the show. There we go, there's a bit better look at him. Yeah, he doesn't look like a happy boy. I wouldn't too with a head like that. I would be very, very cautious around someone like this. But yeah, it's cool. I like these. I like these guys, I like the Gamorreans. You do need more, so I will still be on the hunt for a second one. Um, when I eventually get my Power of the Force sort of shelf set up. I'd love to get another one of these guys. You've got to have more than one, at least. You can sort of see the fur sculpted nicely on there. It looks good. And some of the details and sort of shading and weathering and stuff. It's still pretty damn good for the time. 1997. The return of Star Wars to the everyday mainstream in a lot of ways with the special editions and the, the upcoming prequel films. It was, uh, I still remember it to this day, the feeling I got getting new Star Wars toys as a 10 year old, 9, 10, even a little bit earlier than that. 
But yeah, probably around 9 or 10 is where I really sort of appreciated it. I would understand the value of collectibles and being able to display them. But yeah, this is the first video back for Power of the Force Fridays. I hope you enjoy it, guys. Um, yeah, any requests, please go check back through my catalogue here on my YouTube channel. Um, the videos, the, the thumbnails do jump out at you, so it shouldn't be too difficult to track down. If there's any requests for figures that I haven't done or haven't got, you know, then they're not... They're not that they're not that expensive. I can afford to jump on eBay and grab a figure or two. If there's any requests for figures that I don't have, um, I'll do my best to acquire them. Um, but if there's any you want to see in particular, let me know, and uh, yeah, I'll try and try and hit you up with a Power of the Force Friday request. But yeah, love the Gamorians. Long live the pig! All right, folks. Thank you very much. We'll see you on another video real soon. Till then. May the force be with you, always.